Okay, this is a 2009 Toyota Highlander. I just put a hitch on it. And it sticks out a lot. I mean, looking straight down, I guess it's not so bad, but it's really, it makes your car look like a truck. I mean, really, really, really looks like a truck. But anyhow, uh, there's a company hidden hitch. Maybe they make a better one. You might want to look at that. But uh, these are the tools I needed. Snips, Phillips. Uh, a couple of regular screwdrivers, 17 millimeter socket, 15 millimeter socket, and there was two of those um, hook things bolted onto the frame. They had to come off, and I was able to put one of them back on, and the other one just wouldn't fit. And then I had to trim out some plastic um, on this side, on the driver's side, and you can see it's about 12 inches, but that's where the tow hook came through, and, and so you just had to elongate that hole. And I'll shoot a picture of that. And then here are all the bolts that hold the other tow hooks, little tow hooks on. So going underneath the car, we'll see. You can see why it sticks out so much. It's because the spare tire is right here. So they kind of, I guess no, the spare tire is up against that over there. So you probably, I guess you could flip it up in there. But I don't know. Anyhow, so here's where they had to cut the, uh, cut the plastic out. There's the hook that I was able to use so there's like a square hole there you can kind of see the square hole you just had egg it out and then you had to snip it right there to get it around but you got a those round head screws are at the bumper and the square head ones are every place else and then you got those other little things you got to pop out with two screwdrivers there's a couple screws way up in here and then on the other side yeah you couldn't put the you couldn't put the hook on. Um, it would have went on with those two bolts. Well, that's where it was, where those two bolts are. And then, you know that. And this other panel went on. And uh, you just crush the piece of the um, plastic, like where the front bolt is. It's just kind of, um, uh, you see how it's got that little bend in the, in the plastic right there? Well, that's what it was, where that bolt was. So it's just when you tightened it down, it just smushed it. So it's no big deal. So there's a round screw that goes at the bumper, and the square ones are back there. Um, that's about it. Um, it took about, I don't know, half an hour. All right, see you later.